Alright guys, I must be insane trying two parts at once, since I normally run out of things to say. I might just know that, so I had to talk about tons of vloggers and stuff in the last part. But here it goes. My second part, in a row. Hopefully this isn't suicide. Oh! You have duped me with rabbit your fell trickery rubit. Apparently I did something to that dude, which tricked him. Aren't I nice? Amazingly nice. Yeah. Maybe I should have read that quest. Mm. Also, I was actually wondering something, guys. Uh, can you actually hear me clicking this? No, that wasn't what I was wondering. I was wondering something else. I was wondering if you think I should keep doing commentary like this, straight off the bat. Or, if I sh um, should start just kind of making it and everything now, like I'm doing right now, you know, playing the game. Then recording afterwards on Audacity, so I can speed this up to about two times or so, and everything will go much quicker. Well, I've got a lot of things to accept. Did I not accept his class? I'm sure I did. Oh no, there was another second one. Another second one. There wasn't another second one. How could there even be another second one? Um, uh, retrieve the head of Lord Melanus. Well, that sounds nice. Good luck. Darkness. Where are all these quests actually? They all in. Oh, they're all over the place. That's brilliant. To Darnassus. I'm not actually going to do that one yet because that seems like a leaving area quest, and I want to do all the quests in this area. So let's do that. Also, I was wondering if you want me to do some PvP and dungeons on this, because you know I'm not exactly sure what you want to see. So, do you want to see me doing PvP dungeons and stuff like that when I actually reach the required level for it? And still, guys, no votes on what kind of dude you want this dude to become in the talent tree down here. And I'm two levels off. So, yeah, I'm probably just gonna, if you leave me to choose. This is my first druid, in case you haven't noticed. If you, have, if you end up just leaving me to choose it, I'm probably going to end up choosing uh, whichever one lets me change forms, because that's what I'm most excited about, about a druid. And also, I'm real, I was a bit um, sceptical about this night elf at the beginning, because, as I've already said, I hate elves with a passion. Uh, I think they're just flimsy dudes who don't know how to carry an axe. I love dwarfs, if you guess you haven't noticed. Or in case I haven't told you, which I think I have. Yeah, I did have because I asked what's your favourite race, didn't I? So yeah, you already know that. Dwarves are amazing, elves are stupid, but it doesn't seem that bad when it comes to spellcasting. Maybe I should give elves a second chance. As in, not at all, because, you know, perhaps it's just these elves. And also, I'm starting to get a bit annoyed at things like this at the moment, because, you know, why can't people come again attacks? Yes, I am. Why can't, uh, thingy people come up with new classes anymore? Re not classes, races anymore. Why do we always go to J.R.R. 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 Tolkien's Lord of the Rings, I presume. Okay. He did, uh, he did dwarves, elves, and humans. Those are original. That's it. You have to have those three in the video game that is like this. You know, fantasy and all that. You have to have them as your classes. Let's face it. And every MMO that is kind of like this, World of Warcraft, has those classes. Those classes are just the. You have to have them. If you're doing an old medieval kind of game where you have swords and shields and magic and all that crap. I have to have those three classes. It's like a rule somewhere. I think that's stupid. You should come up with more original classes like, I don't know, a 20 foot troll that is in fact a mage. I mean, have you noticed that as well? I know it, I know it's probably kind of, you know, right that dudes who are skinny and that should be mages and dudes are all buffed up and that should be like fighters, but I don't think it's interesting. I would love to see a massive freaking troll or something with a little, you know, skirt type robe thing on. I mean, come on, that's a lot more awesome than seeing. And also, this dude's wearing the entire wrong thing. A, a druid's kind of like a mixture of combat and, you know, uh, 
spells because they're kind of like the battle mages of World of Warcraft. Because I've noticed that I'm wearing level level uh, level armor at the moment. I'm like, what the hell? Level armor. I'm used to wearing cloth armor because I love casters, and casters can only ever wear le um, leather cloth cloth brain think cloth. Yeah, it's cloth. Good. I only ever wear cloth armor. Killing birds. Come on, stupid pointy eared thing, kill it. Also, I failed to mention Undead in when I was saying races. Undead is literally, besides from goblins, the only thing that really appeals to me on the hard side. Because, not because I like anything about them or anything, I just like the look of them. I mean, come on, they just look kind of like Herp, Derp. Herp, that's actually in there, one of my own dead characters, Herb, Derp, Herb. And it's just, uh, yeah. You know, oh my god, my arm's falling off. I will stitch it back on. It's fine. It's not as if you're gonna die. Just because you're already dead. It's just amazing. I've got a song stuck in my head. It's less than three by Ed Plants. You know, I mentioned him in the last video. Amazing artist. Really talented. Amazingly talented. Oh, I should have mentioned Macintosh. Yeah, Macintosh is actually one of my friends, Sam. And don't think I'm being kind of biased because he's my friend. He is an absolutely amazing animator. I mean, amazing. He... I don't know where he gets his patience from. I once tried to do this animating thing back when I was like 12 or something. And I kind of got bored and I was using dough at the time. You know, that weird Play-Doh stuff, modeling clay stuff that you could kind of model into stuff. And I was using modeling clay. And they ended up getting bored, screwing it all up and throwing it against the classroom wall. Not a very patient person. To get bored. Fast. Especially when I was little. And by little I mean little. Well actually I'm not exactly little. I like making fun of people who are smaller than me. Because I'm used to being small, and over like the past year, I'm like, yeah, I'm big. So I just kind of make fun of everybody who's less than about a foot smaller than me. <laughs> it's really not a good idea. Uh, and it really annoys people, but, you know, I do it. Not one of my better features. So if you're small, kind of like Jess. Jess, uh, yeah, Jess is Sam's girlfriend. And Jess absolutely hates me, yeah. Because I make fun of her because she's small. Well, probably not the only reason, but one of the reasons. Yeah, and I call everybody who's smaller than me small. Even if they're only an inch smaller than me, they're small. You know what? I ran out of things to talk about to do with WoW like an hour ago. Well, an hour ago is in in the actual Let's Play time, so that's like four episodes ago. I just. Eesh completely out of things to talk about with WoW. Well, actually, I've talked a bit about WoW with the races and classes, so I guess I'm fine, but... You can definitely tell that this is just getting come up with on the spot, can't you? I've not got any kind of scripts. That would probably be a better idea. Writing down a script. I'm too lazy. I don't like things that take time to happen. I need it to happen kind of spontaneously. Like, I decide to create a Let's Play... Uh, uh, not Let's Play a channel doing Let's Plays, and I actually almost didn't, because it took me too long to figure out how. And I just... I tried it like twice before, and I just got bored of trying to figure out how to do it, and stopped. I like to think I've got somewhat patient, which is the reason why I've done it, but to tell you the truth, it's probably because the bits and pieces of knowledge that I've, um, I've actually attained since then, kind of come from this. Uh, I've come towards what I'm doing the third time, the bits and pieces that I've retained, and it's helped me figure out what to do. So, I'm probably just as impatient as I was before, but you know... Oh, come on! Stupid elf. There's my racis uh, racism towards elf coming back again. So, yeah. Oh, lag. Which way am I meant to go? Is that way? Probably. Big arrow pointing in that direction. Is it that way? You know, I was usually signified cake, right? Yeah, sure, cake. 
<laughs> that was literally the first thing that came to my mind. Uh, so walking, well not really walking, floating, 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 moving, perhaps I said, uh, perhaps I should say moving. That's right brain, that's how you string words together. Very good. Okay. Yeah, if my brain could talk, it'd probably tell me to shut the hell up. Is this the right way? I have got a terrible memory and I've got no idea if I'm going the right way at the moment. Did I come from a cave? Oh god, I'm completely lost. Uh. Great. Here, body, body, body. <laughs> Where the hell am I? God. Let's just return to Graveyard, screw it. I love how they've got that feature in it. Well done Blizzard, and all that. Adding features like that, which are amazing. Let's try not to get lost. You can notice I'm just jumping and expecting to do that little twirl. That's the only reason. If you notice I'm jumping, it's just because I love that little twirl night else doing. It's like, come on, happen. I'm begging you game, make me twirl. That sounds weird. Anyway. Running, walking, stuff, moving. I guess. Yeah, moving's a good word. I don't. Think, I don't think I'd use floating or walking and all that. Yeah, moving. When I'm kind of well, moving. Well, I mean, wisp. I think it's called. Sounds kind of like a chocolate bar. Whisper. Whispers are gorgeous. Oh god, whispers are amazing. Try a whisper if you haven't. You won't regret it. Am I going the right way here? I think so. If I find myself back at that cave entrance, I am not going to enter it, and I think I am back at it. Yes, I am. Did I kind of go around here? No. Places to go. Let's try looking at the map. Maybe the reason they give you a map is to show you how to get there. So let's move along here. I can remember, why did, can I always find the path the first time around? Well, this is kind of a complete lie, because, you know, I've only done this once. But why did I find the path so easily the first time around? And yet now that I, you know, died and trying to get up there, I can't find it at all. I can't even get XP while I'm at it by killing a couple of dudes, because there's no dudes to kill. <sighs> I am running out of things to talk about. Yeah, you can tell and stuff, probably. Mm. Don't know. Random subject, random subject, random subject. The cleft. I don't know. Sounds a bit like cleavage. Funny. No, didn't think so. <laughs> ah, yes, I laughed at it. Great, George. This isn't boring at all. I'm not wasting somebody's time. Oh my god, something. Is that like. Can I talk to it? How come I can talk to it? Wait. No. Oh, my body's like back. No, oh, no, it's forward. It is forward. Just keep going. Yes, I found my body. And now I'm alive. Sort of. Too far away. That's good because I should have healed myself a bit really fast. Killing. Is that like my corpse? It's kind of decayed and stuff. That's pretty cool. I never noticed that before. I'm actually not going to have to cast whatever it's called. Reanimate or something. Yeah, I really should come up with a name. What is it? Rejuvenation. Ooh, that got me a good dollop. Dollop. Is that what you say? Dollop of XP? Probably not, but you know. Making this up. Bears go well on. That just reminded me of the song. Listening to my singing voice, I know. It's amazing, isn't it? I don't know. Is my commentary better today or is it worse? I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, I think I'll end it here, guys. So, you know, see you next time and stuff, hopefully.